and rings and sonar power shiny thing. Super fantastic! Fun boom factory! High speed gross out great big! Actually, Alan Zakers, created by Larry Schwartz. Poster Perfect! Directed by Stephen Moverly. Written by Sean Boylan. After traveling 4,008 miles through the Boa Sorte jungle, I have finally found the lost gem of Queen Regina. Now I just need to get myself home. Let's see. Where did I park? My South Sea Super Submarine Seeker. <laughs> Actually, I had just gotten off my bus from school and said goodbye to Mateo, my bus driver. Bye, Mateo. me outside my parents' hotel. Yippee! Hey, Tyre. I hope I didn't keep you waiting under the water too long. Good. I knew that you would find something to do down there. <laughs> Come on, Feather Duster. Come on, Tyre. Let's go see my parents. Did you have a fun time at school today? I sure did! I explored every inch of the Boa Sorte River on foot! I finally found the lost gem of Queen Regina hidden inside a cave full of super sticky sealing lizards! Sealing lizards? Those are the stickiest kinds of lizards of all! I hope they didn't give you too much trouble. <laughs> no, they left the gem on the floor. What you doing, Mom? Lydia Galantine is staying with us again, and she's expecting an important package, but I don't think it's here. Why, good afternoon. Hi, Miss Galantine. Hello, Ellen. It's such a pleasure to see you again. Thank you. Cool leg warmers. Are you here for a big dance recital? Not tonight. I just like to be ready to practice. I'm staying because my sister Renee is getting married tomorrow morning. This package I was looking for is going to be Miss Galantine's gift to her sister. I'm afraid I don't see it here, Miss Galantine. I'm sure that it's supposed to arrive today. Hi, Cooter. Hi there, Ellen. Good afternoon, ladies. Just got this package in. Any of you three expecting it? Yes, it must be the gift I got for my sister. The present! Wow, it's really pretty. It's a music box. You just pop it open. <laughs> it sounds just like circus music. <laughs> exactly. My sister loves the circus more than anything. But, oh dear, it's not gift wrapped. I want this gift to be just flawless. And now how can I get it wrapped in time for the wedding tomorrow? I'm not sure if we have any wrapping paper around here. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I'll help you find wrapping paper for the present. Oh, I hope you can, Ellen. I do so want everything to be quite perfect for Renee's wedding. No problem. There I was, floating along past Mount Olympus. It was right after the biggest thunderstorm I ever saw. And the weather was beautiful. In fact, the only thing that could make things any better was a terrific rainbow! And when you need rainbows, there's only one girl for the job. They don't call me the Rainbow Queen for nothing. Not bad at all if I do say so myself. You know, rainbows are really pretty, but the best 
best thing about them is... <laughs> Rainbow Rhymes! the backyard to see if Connie knew where we had some wrapping paper for Miss Galentine. Hi, Connie. Oh, Ellen. I barely saw you coming with all this dust. Well, what are you up to today? I'm trying to find some wrapping paper. Miss Galentine has a music box for her sister that she needs to wrap up. Well, I don't know about that, but if it's anywhere, it's probably down in that basement. I think your dad's down there cleaning up. Good thinking, Connie. Thanks. It was another hot day at the pyramid, and I had an urgent appointment to keep. My pen pal in Paris was sending me a letter by airmail, and I couldn't miss it. There's the mail balloon, and there's my letter. I better hurry. <laughs> going to the basement when I found my dad carrying a bunch of stuff out. Hi, Dad. Connie said you were cleaning out the basement. I sure am. There's so much stuff down there that sometimes I lose track of all of it. Did you see any wrapping paper? Miss Galentine needs some to wrap a present for her sister. Let me see. I don't think I saw any wrapping paper. I saw a rubber puppet and some ranchero peppers but I didn't see any wrapping paper. <laughs> What's that? These are just some of our old posters that we put away. I'm trying to find a place for them, but I don't know where to put them all. Hmm. <laughs> this one is a picture of Daryl McDaniels. He was my favorite skateboarder when I was your age. Cool. And this one is an old poster of a circus. <laughs> I don't even know where we got this. A circus? Valentine's sister loves the circus. Can we let her use this to wrap her present? Good idea, Ellen. Thanks, Dad. Ah, uh, no problem. Now I just need to find a spot to hang this Daryl McDaniel poster. Hmm. On day 17 of my expedition through the savannah, I had finally found it. The perfect spot to try out my amazing new pole bolting technique. <laughs> All right, boys, you know what to do. I don't know if that's going to cut it. Higher! This has to be a really big jump. can get even higher. <laughs> Actually... I had just run back to the office to bring Miss Galentine the circus poster. Did you guys find some wrapping paper yet? Not yet. Dad and I found this old poster from a circus that you can use if you want. Ellen! This poster, it's simply exquisite. In fact, I cannot imagine a more perfect thing for Renee. Yippee! Well, thank you, Ellen. Your mother said you had a real knack for finding things. That was very clever work, Button. Thanks, Mom. Thanks, Miss Galentine. Boy, it sure was a big day. I found the lost gem of Queen Regina after it was missing for thousands of years. I took a big ride through the sky on some of my fantastic 
plastic rainbows, I ran straight up the side of my pyramid to get a letter from my pen pal, and I set the record for the biggest pole ball ever with the help of some of my giraffe friends. After all that running around, I decided to take a break and just look at all the great rainbows I had made. Actually, we were helping Miss Galantine finish wrapping her present. This will be perfect. My sister will love this. Don't forget the bow. Well, thank you, Ellen. The present looked so nice. Everyone thought it was the prettiest present they'd ever seen. Actually. What a pretty gift, Ellen. That was a lovely choice of wrapping paper. Thanks, Mom. Actually, it was. 